Okay, so just in case you're cheating, I'll give you another second to look at the problem before you solve the problem. So find the two square roots of negative one plus i root three. Pause the video. Okay, so here I chose to use radians, but you could have used degrees as well. I was just showing you that uh, it works for both. So our last example is degrees. Here we're doing radians. So you should end up with root two cis of pi thirds and root two cis of four pi thirds as the two square roots of negative one plus i root three. So how do I come up with that if you're confused? Well, first we need to find r. So r is the square root of negative one squared plus root three squared, which is two. The tangent of theta is b over a, so negative root three over one, or I'm sorry, root three over negative one, which is negative root three. Again, I want to recognize here what quadrant is this going to be in. This is going to be in quadrant two, therefore theta is going to be two pi thirds. That is the angle where tangent equals negative root three, but in quadrant two. So my original theta is two pi thirds, so I can write z as two times cis of two pi thirds. Now when I do the square root, I have, since it's a square root, I'm going to have two answers. So it's going to be 2 to the 1 half CIS of 2 pi thirds plus, since I'm using radians, it's going to be 2 pi in degrees, it was 360, times 0, all divided by 2, and 2 to the 1 half CIS of 2 pi thirds plus 2 pi times 1, all divided by 2. Uh, this 2 pi thirds plus 0 over 2 is just pi thirds and 2 pi thirds plus 2 pi over 2 is 4 pi thirds. So that's how we come up with our answer. Uh, if you needed to, you could convert this back to standard form as well. I did not specify, so in this case, just leave your answer in trig form. All right, so in conclusion, uh, Demov allows us to easily find powers and roots of complex numbers. Uh, and we want to understand every complex number has n distinct n roots. So if you are asked to find the 16th root of 5, then you should have 16 different answers. Good stuff.